Oh, she's gonna spark on them for sure. 100%. Nope. Oh, she nope. It should just be the rule. The dog walking by, we don't, you know, run at it, right? So, good. Good, good girl. Good. Good. Yes, good girl. Right, but like this is really good, yeah. just practice of, hey, we're around a dog, we're both on leashes, it's not a big deal. It doesn't really even care about the dog anymore. No. Like In today's episode, I had the pleasure working with Washington Capitals forward and Stanley Cup champion Jacob Vrana and his dog Rose. His dog Rose has some pretty severe reactivity that was developed recently and I'm going to be taking you through our entire training session with Jacob and his girlfriend fixing his dog's reactivity. Sit back and enjoy the video and let me know if you have any questions. We'll see you there. You want me to drive or you want it? I want to see you. Okay. That's nope. There you go. Yeah, I got it. There yeah. you go. Come on. Let's go. So what I'm doing is I'm just looking at her, right? No. She's getting all excited. If we let her bark, yeah. right, before she barks, there's like... Awesome. Oh, she's going to bark on them for sure. 100%. <laughs> you got to be crazy, man. Come on. Let's go. So, right, she's looking. She's now getting excited. No. Nope. Good. Good. Nope. Yes. Good. Nope. Yes. Good. So they were walking a little fast, but every time she just starts getting excited, it's not much pressure. I'm just saying, hey, stop. Right? All I'm doing is saying, hey, Rose. That, like, that, you know, I'm just getting her attention. And that's her making her own decisions, right? She's made, I'm not telling her to heal. I'm not telling her to do anything. It should just be the rule. Dog walking by, we don't, you know, run at it. And so it takes a little bit of time to build up, but the timing is so important, right? Like she's standing here right here, right? She's pretty chill. The second she sees the dog, her tail starts wagging, her ears perk up a little bit, right? You can tell the body language changes an instant. If we don't stop it there, well, yes, yeah, she's going to go, right, of course, you know, it's building up, building up, building up, and then it explodes. You're going you're gonna to almost be like a second ahead, right? Yes. You're going to see something like you're already like predicting like yes. it's going to happen, so you're already giving her a little s signal, kind of like... Kind of. Well, not really, though, right? It's all dictated on what she does. Yeah, so if she's chill, yeah. great, yes, like we'll tell her, yes, she's doing a good job. Yeah. But the second she gets excited, it's just, hey, no, right, stop. And then we're going to keep going. That's, like, we're going to try to stay around this dog to practice that. The problem is that like when we are sitting, I think it's butt's Cause when we- Or sit, just like standing there, right? Like when a dog passes by. Today we went to uh, get some, something to eat. We were sitting there, another dog came in and she was just- Yeah. Yeah, she was crazy. crazy. Yeah. So, uh, tried to get that out of the game, you know? Get yeah. her out of the game. Yeah, get yeah. The... So it's it's easier when we're walking to yeah. deal with it or when we stand you can like maybe like walk with it, but when you yeah. sit when, when you sit yep it's like what do you do right so what ideally what we would like to do is if she can walk totally fine and pass dogs she might do it a little bit when a dog passes by but like that's a lot harder here's a good example right i mean you grew up playing hockey right you didn't start playing in the juniors or right you know in college you started when you were four years old yeah Right? Five, you know, I don't know, how old are you? Awkward, actually, yeah, yeah, yes, exactly, right? Yeah, yeah. And you build up to it. So, you know, we're not gonna throw her into a checking league when, you know, she's four years old, right? We wanna build up to that and get to that point. Step by step. Yes, right? exactly. You know, I mean, if we have 10 dogs pass by and we have everything perfect, we can make it so she's not barking at dogs that are walking by, yes. right? Mm -hmm. If we're using it, again, timing has to be perfect. It's the second you see her, and you saw, right? I wasn't using a ton of pressure. It's just, right, all I'm doing is getting your attention. And then we can practice standing here and watching dogs walk by, right? Standing over there where there's more dogs and letting dogs walk by and doing the same exact thing. Maybe we're not, you know, on, on at the first time, we're not gonna be standing this far from the dogs. Maybe we'll stand, you know, a little bit further away. And just when she does well and she perfects it, awesome. Like, let's get a little closer. Let's tell her that this is exactly what you want her to do. Um, but it is really important to make it clear when she's doing something right, 
when she's doing a good job that we're telling her that she's doing a good job, yeah. right? Because she needs to know what's expected. It's, it's really, a, a lot of it is unclear expectation. She doesn't know what to do. She doesn't know why, when, right? She doesn't know how to handle a dog walking by. And what we want to do is just tell her, that's wrong, that's right. Boom, easy. There's two dogs. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay, can we walk towards them? Sure. Okay, this, this is gonna be a great test. Cool, so right, don't even look at the dogs. Oh. All you should do is look at her. Come on, let's go. So right, loose leash right now. I'm not tensing up, I'm not tightening up. Good, nope. Yes. Good. Good girl. Nope. Yes. Good. Good girl. Good girl. Right? So I'm not letting it build up. I'm not even letting it get to the point where she's going crazy. I mean, I, all I'm doing, and she obviously wants to be with mom, but at no point did, is she, right, is she like upset, right? She's, it, all it is is telling her, no, we don't do that, right? Yeah. Just, that's just wrong. I want to see if, what would she do if you... Uh... With me? Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah, gotta so, give her a, try. a little, a little, or just the one thing to remember. Last time when we were doing it, you would often tense up and get really tight and start holding the leash really tight way, way early. Yeah. Just let her walk loosely, right? Okay. And the second she looks at the dog and does anything more than just glance at the dog, right? You know, you're walking down the street, you glance at people. There you go. Look, look, so right, look, she's already worked up, yeah. No, look, look, oh, way too late, yeah, stop, yeah. Nope. So you see how you, you, she started building up way back there, and we didn't, we didn't communicate with her at all. There you go, nope, nope, and walk the other way, yeah. More, yeah. So here, when a dog passes by, I, all I'm doing is looking at her. I'm not tensing up. I'm not holding the leash any tighter. The leash is loose. The leash is loose, right? It's always like this. And when she, right, you'll see her body language. Her body language, she'll like, right, she'll look harder. I'm always trying to like when there is a dog, I'm always looking at that and trying to like get to yes. the moment. Yes, and that's where we, right at that moment is where we want to give her enough pressure to make it clear, no, we don't do that. No more than that, but if we, a pop and she just ignores it, we're not using enough pressure. All it is is to get her attention. And it's not hurting her, right? I mean, yeah. you, I mean, you saw it last time, right? It's all we're doing is just, hey, look at me, right? Get, yeah. Getting your attention. And it has to be really clear, right? The clarity. We, we don't want her to be confused. Oh, like, was that right or wrong? Like, what was I supposed to do there, right? We want to make a big, no, we don't do that. And then when she's not telling her, she's doing a good, right? Yes, good girl. How do you guys say that? Like, she go now. She go now, yeah. yeah. That means like a good girl. Yeah. She go now, yeah. Right, and so as you get close to the dog, just relax yeah. and keep the leash loose, le leash, leash loose. And the only time is when you're just getting her attention. And it's gonna be a little bit more pressure than that, right? A little bit more. And I would hold the leash right yeah. there. Yeah. Yep. Right, and don't even worry about the dog. Look, she's already, right, like, yeah. I'm gonna tell you when. You can keep walking. I just, and it's, it's pop back, not up, back. Yeah. yeah. Good. Yes. Now. Yes. Good. Right, and if you could be really consistent with that, she's not even going to think twice that there's a dog passing by after a day or two, right? Yeah, yeah. No. Nope. 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 Right, now we saw what she has. Yep. So this is perfect. Yes, this is perfect. This is is perfect. perfect yes, like example, like, exactly. You don't Good girl. Yes. What so she do so it's, this is what she does when we eat. Like, when you're sitting down outside, yeah. awesome. Like, Let's. Like a second of and dogs are gonna just bolt out of there. So this yeah. is perfect. So we're standing at Starbucks, right? And I'll stand right next to you. So you know she's as if she's with you. You know, stand stand next to you. Yeah. So look at her. Look at her body language. Yeah. Nope. Yes, good. Nope. Yes. Nope. Yes. Right. So when it was when it was a really big distraction, it was more pressure. Yeah. Right. She she wasn't. You know, she's not mad at me or anything. Yeah. yeah. But when it's a little bit, it was a little bit less pressure. And all I'm doing, good girl. 
is getting her attention, right? No, we don't do that. And I'm allowing her to do whatever she wants. And all I'm doing is saying, yes, that's good, no, that's bad. Really, 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 really clear. So you could tell like she was ready. She was like, oh. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I know, yeah. yeah. And that was, that dog was over there, but like when they walked like by us, just like. Yeah. But if you let it build up. Like, break the lead. That's the thing, if you let it build up, Right, she's never, she's never going to build up with me because I know how to handle it, right? Yeah. Because it's, it's all about the pressure. Always, it starts with this, loose, the loose leash, yeah. right? If it's ever tight, things are going to build up. She's going to get frustrated and pull into it. So, right, just watch her. That's all we're doing here. Like we're sitting here eating lunch, yeah, right? Exactly. Yeah. Good. And it takes a little bit of practice, right? It's, it's, it's not going to be. No. No. Yes. Good. Yes, good. So what I did there, th those are completely different ranges of pressure. Yeah. Right, and I gave her a good amount of pressure. I gave her pressure and she just completely ignored me. Yeah. So my response was to add, more, just to get, right, again, I'm not trying to get her to stop barking. I'm just trying to get her attention, really. Yeah. That, like, that's the whole idea of this pressure. There's a dog coming by. This is good, but she, it's gonna surprise her, so be ready. Yes, good. Nope, that was, yes, perfect. She got me. She got awesome, me. that was, every single one of those was perfect. <laughs> right, you didn't let it build up, you saw it immediately. So here's another dog. Yes, good. And if she's not doing anything wrong, she that was really solid too. I think you maybe there was one that you shouldn't have done, right? If she's calm, yeah, we th we don't want to do it. Yeah. But that that was also perfect, yeah. right? We're just like kind of desensitizing it. Yeah. Dogs walking by, and it's really clear what's right and what's wrong there, yeah. right? Oh, here's a dog coming. So right, and don't don't act any differently than you would otherwise. No, now now. You were too late, right? So, good. Good. Good girl. So that first one was just a little late, and then you did it again, and it calmed her down, right? Yeah. She she then realized it, it kind of took a second to reset it. But it was good. But you see how the timing, important the timing is, right? If you let it build up just a second too long. Jacob, you want to try that dog? Yeah. Yeah? It's going to be hard in the street, but... Hey. Right, just focus on her, right? Her, what she's doing. Now, no, more, yep. Yes, good. Yes, good. Yes, good girl. Good girl. Hey, wasn't that awesome? Like it wasn't, it wasn't 100%, but it was, that was, yeah. yeah. It was good. Like, yeah. Right, and you know why that happened? Is you started off the whole interaction with her being really calm. Right, she was, she was, I and mean, she walked awesome with you for like, you know, five minutes. And we passed the dog and she's already calm. Try just a little bit more pressure. Right, because she's not super calm right now. So, look at her now, now. Jacob, yeah. Okay, and then just keep walking. Not a big deal. Good. I didn't see the dog. <laughs> I did not. See the dog. That's why I, was the dog Sorry to interrupt your video. I just wanted to tell you a little bit about these bad boys impact dog crates. I train a ton of dogs and I have a ton of dogs in crates. A crate should be your dog's safe space. An impact crate does that. They are made of high grade aluminum made in America. They are really easy to move around. Your crate is essentially your dog's home. So why not go a little bit above and beyond and get your dog a very nice home. At checkout, use code Ethan10 or use the link in the description below to get your impact crate today. Now back to your video. Nope, nope. That was awesome. That was a... That was good at handling the the adverse... So ideally, there was one little thing there. Um, she was like all the way over there. We always want there right now, if I, if I pop, 
I don't want to pop towards me. I wanted to have direction to it. So I would come down here and do that there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but that was, that was especially at the beginning when like she barked and then you got her attention. She looked at you. Awesome. That's where we would say, yes, right? Good girl. One more try here. You want it? Here, you take yeah, you it. You show, you show. Yeah, I'll show okay. I want to see the right way to pull it, you know? Right, and I'm just relaxed. I'm letting her do whatever. Like, you know, we're standing here eating our Starbucks. Nope. Nope. Yes, good. No. Oh, cool. So I'm just looking at her. No. And the verbal no really helps too. Right, when you tell her no, yeah, she's yeah. like, okay. Good girl. Good. Yes. Right, and then now we can try this. Come on, let's go. Good. And just kind of like desensitizing it a little bit of just, you know. Nope. Yes. Just like practicing getting close to the dog. Yes. Right, and she's looking at the dog, but she doesn't really care. Right, but like this is really good yeah. just practice of, hey, we're around a dog, we're both on leashes, it's not a big deal. It doesn't really even care about the dog anymore. No. Like right now, yes. once we stand here for a bit. Yeah. Good. Looks like we made a lot of progress though. Yeah? yeah? For sure, even, I thought. Uh, even after that first like, uh, I would say session on like training, it was very like, it just helps a lot. Yeah. Like this is very good. Of course, that's why, I, that's why I gave you one. No, this leash is a game changer, that's for sure. Yeah, I agree. It's a, I mean, it's I always it's thought it's, it's forced to have it around the neck, but it's like... No. Yeah, exactly. It's my company's too, like we make oh, them. Yeah, you do? Yeah. yeah. Really good. Yeah, good, Rose. Thank you very much. Pleasure Great meeting you. Meet you. Yeah, yeah. Thank yeah. you, we appreciate it. Yeah, Thank see you guys soon. Good. Yeah, just shoot me a text. Thank right. you. Thank okay. you. If you made it to this point in the video, I really appreciate you sticking all the way through. I hope you found a lot of information in this helpful. I put it out for people like you to help you with whatever issues you might be having. As you may have seen, the entire time working with Jacob Rana and his dog, we used an NCA slip lead. This is my company slip lead. I have designed this to help people. It is the best slip lead on the market. I'll leave it in the description below if you want to get one for yourself. And while you're down there, leave a comment. Tell me what you thought about this video. See you in the next one.